It might be a very efficient recording. However, I am back in Trinidad. We have a lot of things to, to uncover. Yes, I'll take a, little, I'll take a little break after, but everybody deserves a little break. I was overwhelmed, so I needed just to get my head together. Um, need to give special thanks to Anson Motors. They sent me a little DM. They say, hey, we're encouraging you and a couple other influencers. They have a launch of a new vehicle. I didn't do no research on the vehicle because I, uh, well, I saw a picture of the vehicle. But I wanted like my true impression like when I see it and like when I'm going through it. So you all could have the same idea now. So, Anson Motors, Port of Spain is about after five, uh, kind of late. I've seen people kind of inside already, so. Trinidad, welcome back. <laughs> According to what Christian was telling me is that this is like a side initiative. I will have him explain it a bit more after. Um, but they partnering with Arrival Live apparently. And they're going to use some of these vehicles for their defensive driving. Now if you're not too sure, sometimes with insurance in Trinidad, once you have defensive driving, you get a little off of your insurance. And the defensive driving is really just to help your muscle memory for when it is you have little scenarios on the, on the road, right? So. The Proton and uh, three vehicles. I could have swear I saw like a pickup, but let me let me just browse through to see where it has. They have a lot of people here, they have a lot of drinks, have a lot of drinks passing. The DJs, they look like it have a little podium there, so I expecting a expecting a kind of keynote at some point. Um, it's a nice vibe. It's my first time getting invited. I mean, apart from being invited to like the auto salon in New York and. Tokyo at the salon and in, well in Tokyo it's kind of nice to, to see how it is in Trinidad and we up there we're doing good so far we're doing good so far So the first vehicle, I can't remember the name, I can't remember the model, right? But um, it's spacious. I'm a tall person, huh? so the first thing I like is how the steering wheel, how it flats at least. I know my foot not good, I'm bunks. Like a good hair, right? Um, some things I'm sure about is an electric, is an electric steering wheel. <laughs> Um, but it's nice and it's nice and spacious. I love the I love the trimmings. I love the red, the red leather finishing on the dashboard. It feels very executive. Oh, I'm so fan about the pricing and the, the the handle, the handle, the blend, the handle, nice though. I'll be real honest with you. I like old vehicles, but that's nice. This might do anything. The station on the wrong station, but I can't say which station I want to pay it on. Okay, good. <laughs> Bigger X90 to the first one we look at the red 
But if it isn't white, I love white. Can't, can't go wrong with white. Um, I want to believe this is a hybrid. Now, this is just me giving you my um, first impression. So, like, I had no information on the vehicle. Um, but we will talk to someone who will give us like an exact breakdown as to exactly where it is going on. And what is their push for these type of vehicles, yeah? As I'm going along again, a little more informed. So, the red one. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> So the red one, compact, I will consider this the sport version yeah. and the white Hi <laughs> and the white one is more family oriented. Okay. Hybrid, semi-hybrid. Mild hybrid. Mild hybrid and yeah. gas. What's your name? Kira. Kira KJ. Nice to meet Buddy you. Kira, I've been in here. <laughs> Alright, so we're here at it's an event. Yes. Thanks for the invite, first of all. Not a problem. It's always a pleasure to have some familiar faces around. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So, I mean, I like the sport because of my background. Mm -hmm. I like to make noise, right? Right. Um, uh, give me an idea of some of the features that the two share. So, some of the features that they will share is your voice command. Okay. So, one of the key things that we're looking at is comfortability and accessibility. Okay. So you say hi ProSoft and Proto hands to back. So one of the things that they would actually control is your windows, your AC. So if I say hi Proton, sunroof, open we'll sunroof. So with this one, yeah. definitely. Your sunroof will open. So question, does this one come sunroof by chance? I don't as, lie to you. Not as yet. Not as yet. Great. <laughs> Once the market actually demands for something You're more, down. Okay. we will be depend on bringing it Okay, so you have a price range you can give more. This is just a show. So I can give you a price range. Yeah. So the X50 actually starts at $269. That's that good, right? There are two versions, two is the X90. Right. So you have your premium version, which will start at $419. Right. That's the seven seater. Right. And then you have this version, which is the six seater. Right. That would be four forty nine. All right. So the model is this is our X. X fifty. X fifty, and this is the X ni ninety. The ninety. Okay. Yeah. I think I have mixed it up earlier. Yeah, do I apologize? Okay. 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 Any any other hidden feature that you think that we should or you want people to know about the vehicle, like so, that you that you particularly like, or I am all about safety. I'm all about functionality. So one of the features that we actually have is the brake hole. Brake hole. Okay. So there's a button in there that yeah. you can look at after. Yeah. You put that button on. Once that button is on, it comes a complete stop. Yeah. You can take your foot off the brake. Okay. When you're ready to move off, especially after light, all you have to do is smash on the gas and go. Okay. That is one of the key features okay. that okay. I think okay. is really fantastic. Okay. That is a good feature. That's a good safety it feature. Is. Alright. And then in the X90, yeah. you actually have your park assist. A park assist. Oh, yes. as you say that, I think I saw 360. There are 360 cameras on, in On both. both? Yes. Okay. So your reverse cam is no longer just your reverse cam. Right. You have all views of your vehicle. You get the aerial view and then on the X50 you get your side view, your back. View. Right. On the X90, you can actually toggle between it's you to okay. see what you actually want. Okay. 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 So, you know, in a tight space, it will tell you. Yeah. And there are sensors all around the vehicle. Oh, yeah, so, it will, yeah, so you, bumper. you okay. will see okay. the, the sensors that will tell you if you're too close, if you're too far, if a vehicle is passing. Yeah. And you know, you want to change lanes, it will alert you to that as well. Okay. I like it so far. Now, all you know, I like old vehicles. So this is actually a true, it's my true impression of these vehicles. I like, I like the interior. I'm an interior person, so like, okay. I like a spacious interior. The interior yeah. not too busy. And I'm sure the voice command will make things a lot easier instead of yeah. having to yes. toddle and fiddle. Keeping your hands on the wheel. So I guess the voice command could be considered and as again, a safety feature too as well. Everything is at the top of your fingers on right. the wheel. Alright. So you have access to everything that you would need on your wheel. Yeah. When it comes to your voice command, your volume controls, everything is there for you. 
Thank you for the information. No if I see you again, I might harass you for something. That's if, okay. If I need some more answers. That's okay. That's Thank what you. I'm here for. <laughs> so that is the vibes so far, but continue going. What my job, I just take a little drink. It's just a little dry, it's not an alcoholic drink. We don't encourage drinking and driving. And uh, show you some more parts of the vehicle, yeah? Man committee. I, I mean, I have no idea what I'm doing it, but, but I'm here. Both of you like, uh, yeah. you're too new. It's too new to say, like, where the oil, like anything dripping. <laughs> but it's a good night. So you yeah. find this so far? It's cool. It's, it's interesting. That, it's, interesting. it's nice that they, um, they reach out to yeah. so many. I would say not younger in general, but yeah. not mainstream, you know, yeah, 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 like yeah, media, yeah. personnel and creators and stuff like that to so like, to capture event because, I mean, that's where social media and that's where they Yeah, they're trying to catch all corners of the market, they never know social yeah, but, media, so, you know. I mean, I see that real food and like real stuff on that side, I but I try, to, I try to work first, yeah, so, like, because yeah. before like, you know, you get all the stuff, but no, 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 it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good, it's good. Nice to good see you, man. Yeah, bro. Drifted. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right, soon again. You know, Arrival Live is all about road safety. Yeah. And a big part of what we do is education. So uh, we've been working with Arrival with Answer. Right. <laughs> Arrival Live has been working with Answer right. uh, over the last six months. They've been helping us get into some schools, uh, both primary and secondary schools, uh, educating kids on safe road use, right? Because the young kids who walk in the road with their parents today yeah. are going to have to ride their bikes soon or later so they're going to be on the road in another, another way yeah. they'll be using the roads by themselves in another way eventually they become drivers as well right okay. so if we can develop good driving habits good road use habits rather yeah. at a really young age it means that as they get older they become more conscious more aware drivers yeah. hopefully there's um, a chance later correct that is the idea when we keep reinforcing the message from yeah. preschool all the way up so, quick question, to sure. make it short, what do you think about the vehicles that I have here? Um, I'm, I'm actually pretty impressed from yeah. what I understand. Uh, the Protons, the, a lot of the safety features are based on some of the Volvo models. And, yeah. I mean, Volvos have had a, a really good uh, reputation about when it comes to safety. safety yeah, uh, I mean, I was talking to one of the reps and they, they, they likened it to a tank, right? Yeah. Um, <laughs> I really like the idea of a tank, um, <laughs> but but no. In terms of keeping the occupants of the vehicle safe, and there's a lot of um, the, the crash protection systems uh, to help keep other occup other road users safe. safe you know, we tend to think safety as the people inside the vehicle, yeah. but what about the people outside the vehicle? Well, yeah. So yeah, right. I mean, it's, it's, it seems really good. All right, the tanks are inside. Yeah. All right, thank you. All right, we're live. Will you check them out? <laughs> Very new at this. <laughs> going to launch. You know, if I want to check Zoos magazine, I'll go put it. I'll go put it like name some of the places they went. I remember that one place I was running to sit in here went. Mm. Was not Brazil? Was it Brazil? Uh, no. Abu Dhabi. Abu Dhabi. Dubai, Thailand, Germany, Hungary, and Chile. All eyes car content. Yes. Car Happy content Island, launch. Multiple different states. So I'm mm. doing this just for record. Eh? <laughs> when is it you're doing a launch? What is, what is your opinion on some key things somebody should capture if they're new and doing media for, right. for cars on a launch? Well, first of all, you want to know what is actually happening. So you have to right. let your audience know what event you're at. And tonight right. we are at the launch of the Proton brand here in Trinidad and Tobago. I can just, I can just walk off right. right. <laughs> 16, 16, 16. <laughs> right, so that's, that's what tonight is about. And they didn't just launch the brand. Right. They came loaded with two brand new SUVs. Yeah, they did. Right, so, small bit of background info. 
So Croton is a Malaysian company, right? But we had a partnership with Mitsubishi, right? And the Chinese company that bought Volvo and Lotus, yeah, bought in to Proton. And I was thinking that because while he was saying, yes. I was like, you could tell so with some of the designs. If you look at the back of the, the X50, the, yeah, the rear part of it looks a lot like the Volvo X40. Correct. Yeah, you can tell by some of the designs yeah. how much how much partnership goes Correct. into some of these Correct. brands that are coming out now. You know, when you sit inside and you, you, you feel the leather and you look at the build quality and how solidly the door is closing and yeah. stuff like that, yeah, you yeah. know, okay, they step their game they up step, a whole they, lot. They step it up, right? they step it up. I kind of like the new logo too. Yeah. Right? For the, for the Gen Xers and, and, and Gen um, Ys out there, you might remember the Thundercat skirt. Yeah. Know, with the lion over the sword. <laughs> that tiger is, you know, looking like it. <laughs> <laughs> right? So, no nostalgia there. But um, I'm looking forward to the technology in these. Yeah. From what I hear, you take a little page out of the Yaris GR book. We are coming with three-cylinder turbo hybrids. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 190 yeah. horsepower. So that is going to be very that interesting is... to drive on the road. And a three-cylinder and an SUV, it means that I'm sure like when you're on part trouble, I think it's just going to be sipping fuel. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a sip of the time, yeah. you know. So should we do with the partial mm. hybrid? Correct. I know the, yeah, I know the, the the okay. compact is full gas. I yes. love the I love the voice command because the, the I think hey, it took that yes, from yes. <laughs> I can't remember which vehicle I was in that has the same thing, but right. like I say, you can tell the partnerships come together and Correct. it beginning to come like how technology is now, where yes. you're getting a lot of high-end stuff for the same same base price basically. Yeah, and now you can jump in your car and say, hey, play me this radio correct. station or correct, correct. Go, to, go to track number 14, my phone and correct. play that, yes, you know, correct, that kind correct. of thing. Which, I mean, you can do it with Siri on an Apple or um, Alexa on your, on your, or Google on your, on your regular yeah. phone too. But it's nice to know that the car can now do it, you know. Um, so, plenty safety tech. Yeah. So, it looks like a lot of safety. Very technologically advanced engines, voice commands and other, you know, the screens. Um, yeah. I noticed too, inside they have like a, a kind of central um, console, but below yeah. that is open. Yeah. So, ladies, you all will like that for your handbags. That's a good um, handbag storage space. I saw they will put up yeah, the, the, the shoes. They will put the big ones. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? the clutch and all yeah. that kind of stuff. So cars are now really starting to cater for all the different needs that consumers have. Yeah. Not just the basics of, okay, where to put my gloves. Hence yeah. the name glove dots. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But yeah, we yeah. way past those. Oh, yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we passed that off. <laughs> you know? So where we are is at the Proton launch. What we're looking at is at the new brand, the new SUVs, you know. Um, we're not actually driving tonight, but no. we can say that we look forward to we driving forward this vehicle. I hope when this video comes out, giving you all a review of it. You know? We can get a little drive and yes. yeah. yeah. I know you, you know, because I'm driving drift cars and, and, and out in SEMA, <laughs> so you drive some very interesting machines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know? <laughs> yeah, so this gentleman is not backward either when he's traveling. <laughs> you know, so. Um, well, thanks, thanks for your insight. Well, yeah, man. it's good to see you when we talk. So we are, don't worry, we have some more stuff happening <laughs> later in the month. Lovely. So, Lovely. Good vibes, good vibes only. Good vibes only. <laughs> <laughs>